Hey, you wonderful, blessed, excited, ignited people. This is Johan Mankey's G Farm Ministries. Hope you guys are doing good out there and hope you are blessed by the best in Jesus' name. What I want to encourage you this morning, and I just want to say to you, man, if God is for you, who can be against you? I want to just speak peace to your heart, to mind, and your, your mind, will, and emotions, and intellect. I want to tell you, man, God is truly for you, who can be against you. People, I want to declare, God has not given you a spirit of fear, but of love, power, and a sound or self-controlled mind. I just want to declare that over you this morning. I just want to declare, you know, that there's a lot of things coming around, and people are getting nervous. But I'm standing in God's word. What is truth for my life? God's word. Not fact, but truth. I want to declare that this morning. People are getting nervous. They are worried about vaccines, passports, stuff in South Africa. I am laughing. <laughs> God laughs at his enemies. And people are getting nervous. Yeah, but what, what? I say, don't you think God is greater than any wickedness? Don't you think God is greater than what these wickedness people? Wicked people want to do to control God's people. Um, I think God is much greater than that. I think God is much bigger than that. So I want to just say to you, so relax your worries and chill. Because I want to tell you that God is for you who can be against you. People, come on. I take God's word. I just see blessing and favor for the true righteous. I want to tell people, those people are sold out to God. Mentally, physically, spiritually, socially, financially. Those righteous people will flourish in the midst of the storm. Not your up and down Christians. I want to tell that to people. Not the fleeting children of God. Because the Lord sent me those people years ago. The Lord sent me about 20, 20, 21. Those people, Christians that is fleeting. Up and down, then God, then not, and then worse, and then this, and then that, and whatever. That's not fully committed to God's word and God's truth. Those people, will, they will also suffer in the midst of that's what, in this what's happening and still coming. But those are truly sold out to all of these things of the Lord. Sold out in their finances, sold out in their bodies, minds, all of these things. They will increase and multiply, have joy. They have no fear in their heart because they rely on God's word. And that is settled for them on this earth and in heaven. Those godly people will have a freaking jaw of note. So I want to encourage those people that is lukewarm. Christians, they're not denying God. I want to encourage you. Get with the program. Get sold out. Run to God, not from God. Stop listening and putting your ears out to worldly junk and stuff in news and get in fear and not get in faith. You know? Get into junk. I want to tell you, get with it, man. Stop being radical for God and say, Lord, even if it pains me, I'm going to just run with your word and your truth. Not God must save you every time. Give me, give me, give me my name as Jimmy. But run with God. God, I want you to enjoy. I'm blind in my life to enjoy everything. Not just give me, give me, rescue, rescue, rescue me. But start enjoying God. It's, God. it's called relationship. Relationship is not just one sided. It's both sides. Not just one does everything. The other one does nothing. That's no, that's not good, you know. That's like a parasite. So, I want to encourage you, but I want to be fair and I want to be direct this morning with you guys. And so, listen, come on, be sold out to God, run with Him, not a flaky, maybe, yeah, I'm, I, I still do my prayers, yeah, I serve God the way that I think, and now I do read my Bible, and you know what, maybe, and you know what, yeah, I, I, yeah, I go to church now and then, or whatever. And, and no, be sold out to God, don't miss a church service, don't miss everything. Go run with God. Get to a good church. Get into a good place where they, where they have fun with Jesus. Where there's signs, wonders, miracles, healing the sick, raising the dead. Man, people are getting prosperous. You don't mind giving, putting money into that ministry. Seeing God's doing stuff, man. Stop being religious. Stop being offended by freaking money, okay? You know, and start sowing that money. Because if you don't sow money or tithe or give, money becomes your God. I wanted to say that. And people get it big. I, I, I so annoyed continuously, but we don't have to give. You run it percent, you don't have to give. Yes, but you can also be poor. That's also a decision. And also be judgmental. That's also a decision. And okay, give us some of your time and effort. Give that also. Find up a bit, you know, um, other people, and encourage other people. Love other people and share the gospel with some people, not just keep it to yourself. Come on, I'm a bit straight here this morning. But I want to tell those people that it's just up and down. Get with it. 
Because the people around it's totally sold out to God. They're going to maximize their potential in God. They're going to increase. They're going to multiply. They're going to freaking flourish. And then you want to judge them. Yeah, but you know, Johan, you know. Come on, God, the gospel is for everybody. Not for flaky people up and down. It's for everybody. Be sold out. Take God's word and truth. By his stripes I'm healed. You become so very poor so I can become so very rich. Lord, the wealth of the wicked, the wealth of the sinners, land for the just. Run with that. Take that to heart. That is your father that wants to take care of you, but not just give me, give me, give me. But Lord, I want to enjoy my cars, my houses, my prosperity, my blessing. Lord, lead me to go and heal the sick and pray for people, and love people, encourage them with your word and truth. Not to judge them. Come on. It's time for us to get with the program, people. Not be flaky Christians, but love God. Not I'm serving God and all religious and, you know. And, no. It's time for you to get with the program. Start to be investing in the kingdom, man. Supporting pastors and men and women of God. You know, start running with that, you know. Being going to good churches. There's some beautiful churches around there. Yeah, and be sold out. Don't be lazy. Sit on your couch and watch, uh, watch the services by the streaming and stuff. Get back into churches, man. Bible says, do not forsake the gathering of saints. Don't be put to lay hands and encourage people, you know. Don't be in your comfort of your home all the time, serving God. Man, come on. The Bible says that he who separates himself seeks his own will. Stop separating yourself. Get in. Help other pastors. Help other ministers. Help other people, man. That's got the same attitude, same heart, same heart towards the, the gospel of the kingdom of God. Get with that. So I want to get a bit uptight here a little bit. Rah, forgive me. And again, I don't care what the president says. I don't care what the government wants to do. My God is greater than any government. Come on. Are you scared of the ANC? Are you scared of this? Are you scared of that? Whatever. Hell no. I said hell no. Because hell I'm not going. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't care what they decree. God is for you. God lost at his enemies. I'm the child of the most high God. You are apple of God's eye. Who's going to touch that? <laughs> But if you're flaky up and down, you might just get damaged. Now the heart nor you cold. I'm going to spit you out. It means you're unteachable. That's what it means. Not means you're going to die and go in hell and stuff. No. But Lord said to me, I've got obedient children, disobedient children, but they're still my children. People, get with it. Have fun. Be sold out to God. Make a decision. I'm being sold out to God mentally, mind, word, emotions, intellect, physically, my body is God's body. I'm temple with the Holy Spirit. Financially, my money is not just my money. I tithe, I give, I sow into the kingdom. And I help people. Yeah? Emotion, uh, socially, helping other people. Encourage other people. You know? All of this stuff. I'm sold out to God's word. That God says His truth is truth. Although it doesn't look like it around us. It is truth. I'm sold out to that. Doesn't understand it, but I'm sold out to that. Get with the program, people. Come on. I'm going to encourage you, man. You're more than a conquer. God is for you. You can be against you. Get with it. You know? Stop, stop being so separated. You know? Start getting back into churches. Start getting back into to men and women that can teach you and help you. The Bible talks, you know, the equipping of the saints, the apostles, prophets, pastors, all of the evangelists. is there to equip you, to help you with knowledge and wisdom. These men and women, God has been in ministry for many years. They're here to help you and love you. Get into the right place. Get to the right people to help you. Can't just now because of the separation. They want to separate the church. They want to separate men and women of God. Bible says, "With two or more gathered in His name, green touching and is settled." No, the agreement is not anymore. There's problems. You know, one put one thousand to fight. Two put two thousand to ten thousand to fight. Do you see this at oneness? That they want to destroy. We need to get together more and more and, and celebrate God's goodness and encourage and love one another. People, don't for, forsake the gathering of the saints. You know? So please, we also, you're welcome to come on, on uh, um, Sundays, 4 o'clock at GFR Ministries, here by us, or by other churches where they know there's power and glory and they speak the grace and the love of the Father. No judgment, no end time crap and end of the world bull crap. It's just going to get blessing, blessing for those who are sold out to the kingdom of God. I want to be very clear. The blessing in favor is those people that sold out, getting wisdom continuously, be a redemptive revelation on a regular basis. You know, those people will prosper in all areas, not just finance. I want to be stated very clearly. 
You know, people say, oh, the whole church. No, there's a lot of people that are not prospering in church because they're not sold out to God. They serve God the way they think or the way they want. They're fitting God in their lives the way they want to fit God in. No, you, let God come through you in your whole life and be one with God and have fun with God. That's my prayer. Anyway, I'm a verse here today. Forgive me. If I've offended you, maybe good because <laughs> my heart is not to offend but to make free. Okay, maybe for you to get with it, to get excited, man. Well, I'm, I'm going to gym just now. I'm in the gym at the moment. So I'm going to go the millis, yeah, do the gym thing because I'm stirred, shaken and stirred. You know, so now I'm ready to go in because usually the weights beats me and hopefully I'll beat the weights today. We'll see. <laughs> you know, so but anyway, guys, love you. Bless you, man. Johan Mank is GFL signing out. Love you. To the full. Till it overflows. It's time to get with it. Get excited with God. Get sold out. Get back into churches, people. Get back into places. Of, well, don't have to uh, church, but in groups and stuff. To be encouraged, be loved. And give some of yourself to other people as well, man. You know, share the good news. Get excited, man. Signs, wonders, miracles. I'll follow those who believe. Read what it says. Signs, wonders, miracles follows those who believe. If signs, wonders, miracles follow you. If it doesn't, there's a problem. I'm not judging. I'm just saying that's the Bible. Anyway, guys, time for us to be prosper in all years. Financial men, I pray God will just bless you out of your socks with money, man. And you'll be a great giver in that. Because money, if you hold on to that, with hold on, then you'll get poor, the Bible says. But if you scatter this, it comes back and you increase. The Bible says that. Okay, so sowing and reaping. Sow and you reap. Amen. Anyway, I'm digressing. Come on, people. It's time for us to get with it, get excited to the full till it overflows in Jesus' name. Love you. Johan Manke, again, signing out. Love you. Give me some feedback. Give me some love. Give me some hate. It's fine. Anything. Subscribe, YouTube, Facebook, all that stuff. Man, bless you to the full till it overflows in Jesus' name. Sign out. Be blessed by the best in Jesus' name. Amen. Bye.